director, and I am a, uh, a NORAD spokesperson. Let's talk for a second about the fact that this is really, really good news. Sixty years NORAD is uh, tracking Santa Claus. So tell me how this all got started. Well, it started back in 1955 when uh, a local newspaper ad mistakenly put the uh, a phone number to our control center telling people that they can uh, call Santa. Um, that was, of course, on December 24th in 1955 when this incorrect phone number was uh, was printed on a local Sears and Roebuck and Company uh, newspaper advertisement. Okay, and so, so uh, instead of, uh, of course, one that rang uh, rang in our control center, the uh, commander at the time, uh, Colonel Schaup, um decided to use the radars and track Santa, and anybody who called in, he gave them a, an up-to-date location. Fantastic. So now tell me how the technology has changed over the years. Well, uh, our technology is always advancing. Uh, we have a series of, uh, of radars and satellites and, uh, and other military uh, apparatus that enable us to track Santa. And that's part of our mission that we're doing every day, right, to keep it um, track planes and space launches and anything that flies in and around uh, the North American continent. Okay. Now, the idea, the, I know Santa, uh, you know, with the, 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 the a wink of his eye and, a, a, you know, a nudge to his nose, off he goes. How in the world do you track a, a, an individual that goes that fast? Well, we have some very advanced military equipment that can detect just about anything. But, uh, you know, we've been doing this a long time. Uh, we're, we're in contact with Santa, and uh, we're honored to be his official tracker. Fantastic. All right, so so when does it all begin? I mean, did, does it officially start on, on Christmas Eve, or does it, uh, do you actually track him in any, any practice runs? <laughs> well, if he didn't need to do a practice run, he'll definitely let us know. But, uh, yeah, this all starts up on uh, December 24th, and then starting at... Uh, Starting on that day, you can actually go to the uh, the website and get his uh, his location. Now, can we pinpoint exactly when he's going to be over Missoula, Montana? <laughs> uh, we cannot uh, say exactly when, but uh, he does come in the in the early evening, usually between you know uh, nine nine and midnight. But uh, you know he does what he has to do, and the time can vary for sure.